Okay, we're back. I kind of screwed some stuff up. I'm using my own music this time. Anyway, as I was saying, I'm naming this person. Reminds me of the woman from Alien. I forgot her name, though, so I'm naming it after the director for Alien, Ridley Scott. But then I realized, why not just be Ridley from, from Metroid? And then uh, I decided, you know what? It's going to be Ridley. Let me find the blue skin so it'll look like Ridley. Kind of. So instead of Ridley Scott, it's just going to straight up be Ridley. And uh, Green Man, uh, it's going to be the slime from Minecraft. And the other one, uh, let's see here. We've got like... Poop? No, no, pee. Okay, we got poo and pee, but I don't... I'm trying to think of... Yellow, green, Shrek? You know what? Yeah, Shrek. Sounds awesome, Shrek. Shrek. I can only use that joke once. Oh well. And then the last one, that was gonna be, uh... Hmm, okay. Red... Mantis. Red Mantis. Uh... I'm trying to think... Of, ow, I'm trying to think of red characters. Just anybody who's red, anyone at all. Uh, you know, we'll go with the Metroid thing and make this one Samus. Samus is more orange, but I don't really give a fuck. We're going with the Metroid thing. We got we got a slime from Minecraft. We got Shrek. We got Samus, and we got Ridley. I don't know why Samus and Ridley are on the same ship, but that's uh that's for someone else to figure out. That's not for me to figure out. Anyway. Let's get let's let's get beginning. Yeah, let's begin. <laughs> I, I I finally had an idea for a non-gaming commentary video. Oh, I just completely skipped over that. Charlie, uh, that's gonna be Charlie Brown. Very simple. I finally had an idea for a non-gaming commentary video to make. Make one about New Super Mario Brothers DS and how just amazing that game is compared to all the other new Super Mario Brothers games. So that's nice. Now the question is, do I put that on this channel or do I put it on a separate channel? My, I want to put it on this channel, but that would be kind of weird. I don't know. I'm, I, oh God, as soon as we got him, he's gone. It looks like he's not going in the thumbnail. I, I would keep, okay, I'm going to start reading them. Your jump leads, okay, well, as soon as I start, uh, we, okay. <sighs> Whatever. I, I will get past this. I've got this. It's going to be okay. All right. Starting now. I'm reading stuff. A station tells you, greetings, Captain. You're the guy's rebel hunt, right? We can help out, but we're constantly in need to scrap to patch up the space bucket we live in. All right. Uh, I have no need for... Oh, I did I... But, but, uh, what? Why does the, the shop music come in whenever I start fighting? All right. So the, the special thing about this is the flak artillery which is uh really awesome and this thing is it's anti-personnel that's just sad oh yeah that makes sense we're supposed to send in a fella to teleport that that makes total sense i should have remembered that flak artillery and it's got a clone bit i mean of course that's yeah that makes perfect sense to me now now that i actually paid attention i was too focused on naming and uh announcing my new idea for a youtube video here we go now, here we go. I'm getting on track. I swear to God, if I die, I'm actually going to click the restart button. All right, right here, we teleport into the weapons. And then we start shooting the anti-personnel leader. Fuck you guys. You're all going to die. All right. Mantis. Mantis, you're going to be okay. I'll, I'll have you. Oh, you're dead. Mantis is dead. Never mind. I'm throwing in that anti-personnel laser because that just kills people. It kills people. And what do I do? I, I kill people. That's my job. That's my, that's my job as the Federation command commander, killing the rebels. So, I mean, I'm going to do what I got to do. All right, get back in there. Disable them weapons. Just get them. Just, just destroy them. You've got this. You're a mantis. Mantis men fight. That's like what they do. I fight, John. It's what I do. All right. Uh, uh, yeah, no, th th you're just going to die. Sorry, mantis. You, you're dead. Oh, here comes the flag. Uh, surrender? No, no surrender. No, uh I'm not like that. I don't accept surrender. The only thing I accept is blood. Or cash. He tried to give me some cash, but I, I meant like space dollars, not scrap. Yeah, I don't know why scrap becomes the currency of outer space. I, you'd think it would be like 
Federation bucks or rebel dollars or something like that. Do they have a clone bay or something? They just have like an endless supply of people. Uh, what the hell? Kajab. Kiyayav. Dead dude. That's what he's called. Oh, we got Winslow. Now that the station is emptied of hostiles, you run a complete search. You discover a prisoner who offers to join your crew. We got Winslow. Uh, Winslow, I'm gonna rename him to Winston, like from Overwatch, just cause that's, oh, uh, whoops, just cause that's, that's an easy one, that, that's easy. Though, I'm gonna, whatever media character I can think of that's close enough to their name, I will, I will take. Unless I have to, like, come up with something else, right? So, that's what I'm gonna do. This guy right here, I'm gonna put him, I'm gonna put him on the fighting team. He's on the fighting squad. He fights. That's what he does. And we're also gonna put, we're gonna pour everything into the flak artillery, honestly. I feel like that's the best thing we can do, just cause that fires automatically. I can focus more on doing my whole shtick about, uh, fighting on the inside with my guys. An unidentified ship is badly damaged and still assaulted by a space pirate. The victim begins a distress message until the pirate cuts it off and offers to split the bounty if you sit in tight. Sit tight. Nah, I'm a hero. I am a hero. What do you mean try to be a hero? It's ju I should just be be a hero, cause that's what I am, a hero. I will, I'll save him. I am a good guy. I'm gonna, I'm here to prove that the Federation is good guys, not bad guys. And I just killed one of my own men. Oh, spectacular. Amazing. I'm a, I'm a military genius. That's what they call me. They call me commander. Well, I'd assume the, the, the people that I control actually do call me commander, but that's besides the point. Oh, there's a, you know what? The sensors are overrated. I don't need to sense shit. All I need is fighting power. Th them's, them's is fighting words. That's what they... You know what they say. Them's is fighting words. That Zoltan will blow them both up. Oh, keep keep the O2 down. The pirates are all dead, leaving the ship dead in space. You scrounge what you can from the ship before contacting his former prey. Upon closer inspection, you realize the ship under attack was a rebel scout! It's too damaged to put up a fight. Convince them to delay. Why can't I just be cool with them? Why can't I just be like, hey... Not all Federation dudes are bad. We're cool. We'll spare you. And then just, like, con convince them to be our friends. And then have them join our ship. And then I can put them on the fighting squad. That's my goal. Build up the fighting squad. As, as big as possible. ABAP. ABAP. It's like as quick as possible. AQAP. Except better. I just threw those two in. I threw them in just to die. That was completely pointless. I don't I don't want to divert Mr. Power and Mr. Electric, but I don't really care. Oh, that's an amazing name. If I get another Zoltan, next time I get a Zoltan, I'm naming him Mr. Electric. <laughs> like, <laughs> which Mr. Electric? I'm going to go with uh, George Lopez, Mr. Electric from, from Shark Boy and Lava Girl. <laughs> oh my God. You know what? If I get a red-haired humanoid, it's going to be Lava Girl from, Sh from Shark Boy and Lava Girl. All right, fix, fix it, fix it. Come on, stop dying. Yeah, come on. All right, there we go. I'm gonna actually give my sensors an upgrade just so I can have a better time fighting these dudes. Now let's uh, do we want to get all roundabout? No, they're not spreading at all. They're they are delayed. The rebels are like, hey, they spared us, so they asked for you guys to just chill for a second. I assume that's what they say. Once you arrive, your screen lights up with warnings. A nearby pirate seems to have advanced hacking tools, and they have tried to shut down our engines. Your crew manages to keep them barely operational, and you move them into attack. All right, yeah, uh, we've got a rockman and a human. Not cool. I'm gonna try and okay, yeah, no, this isn't this isn't ending well. This is not ending well at all. Uh oh, as soon as I almost fired that, and that guy. That's gonna make me real mad just knowing that he was that close to dying. And up oh, hole breach. Right there though. It doesn't really matter if there's a hole breach right there. Anyway, he's he's dead. I'll have him run away just so we can end that last guy. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> that's uh, that's kinda sad, honestly. Alright, I'm gonna throw this guy's low. This guy the uh, single mantis can handle him just fine. I'll send the other guy in just to pick up the slack, I guess. I'm not letting him repair that oxygen. You are not repairing your O2, dude. Oh, he's going all the way to shields. You are not repairing your shields, dude. I'll get the thing ready, so if he flees to O2, I'll just kill him. Alright, you know what? There we go. 
With the power ship disabled, your engines come online again. You salvage what you can from their ship. Hell yes. Thank you very much. All right. You two, uh, just get back. Get back to your stations. All right. I think shields and engines are definitely going to be a priority. Usually they are, but especially for now. Uh, I'm not fighting an automated rebel scout. There's no oxygen in there. I would, I would be able to do actually nothing. Because I would usually I prioritize this, especially on the other two ships that come with artillery. But here I feel like prioritizing artillery is not the best idea. Definitely prioritizing getting down that clone bay. I do not want that clone bay functional. And oh my lord, no, thank you. Not cool, dude. Oh, this is not fun. Oh my, my, oh god. There, oh god, oh, this is just pandemonium. This is like the worst case scenario right now. All right, we gotta, we don't have any repairmen. All right, uh, shields are freaking down, dude. I'm swapping, I'm swapping these boys out. Nah, you know what, whatever, we're gonna have to. That was just sad. You know what, that was so sad that I'm gonna click restart and restart right from the beginning, right where I was before. Well, not right from the beginning, it's still a new map and all, but same same crew. I'm not letting this glorious crew go to waste. That's an amazing crew. All right, uh, leave. I don't want I don't want any stores. No thanks. I'm gonna, I'm making this work. You arrive near a damaged and dilapidated space station. It appears to be abandoned, but you detect faint life signatures on board. Look for them. We got Whisper. Whisper. Oh, you're on the fight squad with Samus. All right. Whisper, whisper, whisper. Do I like? What? 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 No, no, no. For the thumbnail, no, no whisper, no whisper on the thumbnail. Instead, um, uh, you know what? I'll get back to that. For now, you're just gonna be W H. I'll get back to that. I'll come up with a name in a second. Uh, right here. I'm trying to think. Whisper. Uh, oh, what, what the hell? As soon as you arrive, a small Federation fleet detachment jumps in. The ships show heavy damage and their weapons are still hot. We had to retreat. There were just too many of them. How could their greed have fleet have grown so fast? Ask for help. A bomb with a weapon. Okay, yeah, sure. Whatever. I don't really care. Um, uh, uh, we, Wheatley. Wheatley! Yes, that's perfect. A pirate ship w was lying in wait inside this asteroid field. It immediately moves into attack. Yeah, no. No thanks. We're going to lock down that O2. Beat them while they're down. That's what I say. <laughs> That's my motto. Beat them while they're down. And our, oh, our artillery's down. Oh, well. And she's dead. Oh, we got a secondhand Bardisha beam. Sweet. And we've got to wait out all this BS before we can teleport them back. Secondhand Bardish beam. Is it Bardishay? Is that what it's supposed to be? Right, I'm gonna jump to hopefully a dead sector, <laughs> or dead jump, <clears throat> jump beacon. Uh, demand the surrender of their goods. Yes, that's not dead. That's not dead. Waiting for that to repair, and then I'm going in to screw them up. But first, I'm switching the music. Sorry, rules guard, but it's been seven minutes of the same song. Uh, I'll skip it one more time and just take whatever it gives me. Oh yeah, I'm taking what it gives me. Yes. All right, this is loading, and wait, that, that missile does not have shield piercing. That's kind of goofy. I'm going to be real. All right. Uh, we're taking that hit, aren't we? Uh, right on the thing I just repaired. You got to be shitting on my pants. All right. No, thanks. Yeah, you dead. You dead, son. All right, this is just, <clears throat> this is just sad. I need, like, an NG on board so I can have him repair everything, or maybe two of them. Like, right here, I can select them and have them repair. Oh, they're gone. All right, well, better time than any to Wheatley. Wheatlify your Wheatley now. Wheatley and Samus. Show kind of reminds me of Samus. They're both female protagonists with guns. And they fight a uh, rogue AI. One being comedic, one not being comedic. Uh, all right, you and you. And that's going to be the first upgrade. And then the second upgrade is going to be reactor core. 
And I'll die. Ah, double clone bay. I was not aware that I had a double clone bay thing going on. That's kind of awesome. I'm just going to sweep the entire thing. I'm not too powerful, especially with my artillery being done. A ship with pirate marking hells you. Uh, no, I don't want your I don't want your subsystem Artemis missiles. Was that, did it say subsystem Artemis missiles? What the hell? All right, send in those guys right there. Would be a bad idea if it wasn't for this. And they'll fight me right there. All right. This is going to be difficult. Getting them... Hitting them while they're down. They're going to start fleeing. So we need to hit them where it hurts. Particularly oxygen. Because if oxygen hurts. Not having oxygen. That hurts. So if we keep them occupied with zero oxygen. All right. Yeah. You know what? I'll come in there for a second. And, uh... I'll have the Mantis camp him out. And uh, splitting the party was not the best idea. Okay. Sensors are down. I'm gonna have to take the hit. I'm keeping their oxygen down for as long as possible. Okay, got one of them down. And we're just sustaining heavy ass fire, dude. This is not good. All right. That last Denji's going to get his oxygen down. So that's going to suck. If I can do that, though. Oh, he's, he's in the pilot room. All right. So here's what I'm going to do, right? Hear me out. Hear me out here. I'm going to... All right. So I'm going to have to split up the party again. But this time, I'll do it right. Yeah, he wants to fight in there. All right, yeah. I'll just have them both wreak havoc simultaneously, because this guy can't handle... He can't handle the this guy. And if he comes to handle this guy, I'll just send this guy in. So, no matter what, he's kind of screwed. All I have to do is send, send this guy in to just go and destroy everything. Specifically, weapons. I do not like them having their weapon capabilities. And there's a, there's a fire in the artillery. All right, bringing their weapons down is great. They're focusing on their their missile thing, which isn't going to do them much good, honestly. Brought that down. Let's uh let's make sure that he's not fixing any oxygen. That's not allowed. Yeah, no, you're not. I'll bring you in here. If you really want to fight so bad, I'll bring you in here. And I'll bring this guy over here. Alright, so he's being he's being kind of obnoxious. Alright, I brought him in here. Now I'm gonna have him do like this, right? Catch him, catch him! No! Catch him! Fight him! Beat his ass! Beat his ass! Yes! There are no more life signs remaining on the ship while salvaging the crew discovers that the ship was carrying some trade goods. You order sweep. Got some space rations. All right, now we've got a fire to attend to. Uh, not not very fun. Uh, hope it's not in the oxygen. All right. Now I'm just gonna kind of aerate all that kind of stuff, you know, keeping it aerated. I think that's a good idea. All right, is it? Yeah, we're good now. Time to send in the repairman. And that they're gonna die. That they're they're actually just gonna. <laughs> they're dead. They are not dead by. Surprise luck, not dead. Alright, right here, done. Right there. I'm gonna upgrade that engine. I need as much dodge as I can get. As many times as I can dodge, I will dodge. I, I will dodge for the life of me. I will have full engines and no shields. If it means I can dodge shots. I don't know what's more important, dodging or being doing normal. Who knows? I'm gonna count this all as run number four, by the way. Because I didn't really get far enough for it to be its own thing. Give them fuel? Yeah, sure. And they gave us some extra scrap, which I will put into that. And then we can go uh, here. I'm going to sell the secondhand Bardiche beam. So yeah, uh, 15 scrap. As good as a new one, but cheaper. Oh, okay, well fuck me then. Never mind. I can can I sell some space rations? One bar of this stuff can feed a humble colonist family for an entire month. Oh well.
I guess not. Whatever. I'm just gonna heal and then call it a day. I'm gonna, I guess, try and get weapons, but this is more of a, a teleportation kind of ship. Melee combat and all that. Alright. Uh, definitely gonna have to play some of the same shenanigans we did last time if we want to pull this off. And by shenanigans, I mean, wait, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Okay, there we go. Getting that, getting that timed properly is a real important. All right, of course O2 goes first. I mean, that's just obvious. They don't get oxygen. My, oh yeah, I don't have upgraded sensors, do I? All right. All right. They're both dead. All right. Oh god. O2's coming back up, isn't it? I could I could jump. You know what? I am going to jump. I'll cut my losses. Another one? Oh my fucking god. I'm tired of this. Can, can we get rid of this hazard? It's so aggravating. Please, please, god. All right. Oh lord. Oh lordy Jesus. All right. Going to the weapons. Yeah, he got tricked out right there. They think they're funny. They think they're goofy. They think they got this, but they don't got this. I've got, I got lasers on my side. Watch. Whoa. Oh, I just, I screwed that one up. Okay, there we killed all the crew. It's, it's extremely aggravating. Just, just that, that entire hazard. I swear to God, if I see it one more time, in a row. Okay, thank God. Uh, cell 10, yeah, I don't have any use for missiles at all. Alright, uh... These two are probably gonna die. This is pretty rough, honestly. I'm gonna go for... Hmm... Honestly, I, I kinda wish I could I had the money to buy that NG back there. That would... Being, be, being able to beef up the home support would be really awesome. But I'm gonna go here... And, yeah, I'm going to save the rest for upgrading shields. I'm going to let them die. Please die. Please, please die. Please, please, please die. Nope. All right. Well, I'm going to bring you over there so you can be at full health because I need you guys at full fighting form. No, I don't want to select you either. I just want this guy. I just want Wheatley. All right. And then this one. All right. Let's get out of here. And we're going to have to go to the rebel sectors, aren't we? What is this? What does this one count as? Do I ever get to know? I guess not. We're going in here. Is it Bardish or Bardiche? I don't know, man. Just crew member? Nope. I'm just really hoping for the, uh, for the birth. You can get a surprise birth and get another thing. Then I can have Wheatley stay at home. Shell the space rations for 40 scrap. Hell yes. Yes, please. All right. I'm going to buy Samendra and have Samendra replace Wheatley. Wheatley will man the cams. And Samendra, you're not going to be, uh, uh, I'll, I'll, I'll figure out something for you in a second. Um, all right. Uh, uh, come on, give me a sun. Nope, no suns yet. I'm not really reading that out. I'm just looking for the sun. I'm not going over that distress because then I have to walk through that nebula. Nebulas aren't very fun, especially whenever you heavily rely on being able to navigate through a ship. Let's get some of that fuel. All right, some. So, uh, no, no, there it is again. Oh, my lord. All right. Shouldn't these guys in right there? Uh, salt, so, so, so. I can name it. What can I name it? I can name it Pee Poo Pants. Yeah, that's that would be real funny, wouldn't it? Pee Pee Poo, Pee Poo. That's that would be real goofy, real funny, real stinky. You know what? I'm just, fuck it. I'm just gonna name it Lay Monkey and call it a, call it a day. God damn. <laughs> that that's it. All right. Uh, with the yay, the crew's dead and there's a fire in the freaking oxygen. Awesome. Start fighting that shit. It's spreading. Oh, it's dead. I'm gonna have to send everybody after this fire. I will, I will, they will die so many times. I will, they, I will let them die if it means fixing the oxygen. The oxygen is more important than anything else. Please be a calm beacon. Please. 
please have some cone bacon. What the fuck? With the heavy rebel presence in the sector, it was only a matter of time until you run into one of their cruisers. They sent a short message. This is RS Wrecking Ball. Our logs show you as a threat level 20 Federation unit. We will open fire with our full weapon array. All right, asshole. Yeah, this is the perfect timing. Real, real nice of you. Real, real cool of you. We, we are dealing with no oxygen. And now we got to deal with you motherfuckers. Thanks. Real, real, real awesome. All right. So, the option here is to run away, clearly. I just need to run. But first, I'm going to take on these uh, these smaller areas that house less uh, less units. We just got to wait for it to get right. There we go. No, I missed anyway. All right. Do I run away? I got to wait for these guys to die before I can run away. He's pretty low, but they have a med. They have a med bay, so you just die and let's get the fuck. Uh, no, I don't have any crew aboard. The Can we go now? Yeah, let's get the fuck out of there. Oh no, I'm not dealing with. I'm not dealing with that big ass ship. Holy crap! Aid the Federation ship. Uh, yeah, I'll tell you. This is if it's a normal one. Oh yeah, to hack my teleporters. Oh, you cock licker. You wee wee licker. You weenish. Not cool, dude. Just not. It's not. Well, there's nothing else I can say about it except for the fact that that's not cool. It's very uncool of you to do that. I'm going to shoot your guy who managed the weapons to get a nice little head start on beating his ass. Oh, that's the music I needed. I needed that pump. I need to get pumped up. Hell yeah. Let's do this. Oh, oh, oh my god. All right. Screw you. Your guy's dead. Missileman's dead. Next up's your captain. I'm going to give vengeance on him for being such a douche. Wheelie, go, go repair that, please. Look at that. Look at that. That's the heavy damage I want to see. All right. Going in there. We are... Oh, we are so close to dying. Ooh. No, 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 no. I will... I got to leave him. I, I have to leave him or else... I'm... Okay. I can't... I don't want to risk it. This, uh, I'm, I'm be, I would just be choosing to lose. Yeah, no, I'll see ya. That hit, that hit, I would have lost. Oh my god, we are not in a good shape at all. We have one fighter now and he's not even a mantis, so we have to leave the other two behind because otherwise they'd be screwed. Oh. <laughs> oh, ha <laughs> ha, turns out it didn't matter. Amazing. All right, well, that sure was fun. I love the series of continuous fails in FTL. I remember the time I had a victory. We can go way, way back when, go to way back when, whenever I had that rock hard victory, I was just ecstatic, nearly shat my pants. Now we're here. Next time I'm going to be using the, uh, oh, whoops, I, I didn't mean to quit. Let me, uh, I'm not going to take the time to reload FTL. It takes forever. I'm going to be using the other version of that same ship. It's like the B-Type. I think that's the really OP one. Just so I could have a win. Anyway, that's for next time. See you then.